Okay, this is a quick overview of our Street Smart app for time card management. It's super easy and it's going to make um, filling out time cards and time management incredibly easier than our previous system. So what you'll do is you'll go to either the iTunes store or the Android, um, the Google Play store and search for Street Smart. It's this green one with a little checkbox on it. When you've downloaded it, put in your name and your phone number and it'll auto-populate all your information in from there, from where we've programmed it on the back end. So once you've downloaded it, go ahead and open it up. The only two areas that we're going to be concerned with are the time cards and the jobs folder. Um, all the other the forms and the exit, you don't even have to worry about those two. So just timesheets and jobs. So let's go over um, the time card. So click on the time card. So when you've showed up to Costco and you're ready to get started work, all you have to do is hit start the time. It's as simple as that. And now it's recording your time. So um, once you've hit that and you go about your job, you can um, have this running in the background and it'll just be continuously um, recording all of your time. Now, if you want to take a lunch break, it's as simple as hitting the pause button, start break. Um, so now you're taking a lunch break and um, it's holding your time. Now, when you want to go back to work from your lunch, all you have to do is hit end break and it starts calculating your hours again. So it's as simple as that. So then go back home and you can just let that run its course through the entire day while you're working. Um, all that time is collected and sent to us, so you don't have to fill anything out, you don't have to worry about rounding up, <clears throat> or no forms or anything like that to fill out. It's just automatically capturing. The other section that we want to go over is jobs. So we'll be assigning all of your Goal Zero Roadshows to this app. And as you can see, I've assigned myself one, the Roseville, California Goal Zero Show. When you open it up, there's some really great things. And you can open this up prior to starting a time card, but it'll show you the summary, which is which, which date the show is going to start, the address for the location, and who the contact is. So you can hit the plus button, and it'll automatically add it to your mobile calendar. You can hit the arrow key, and you can navigate to the location. Or you hit the arrow key, and you can call the manager at Costco and let them know, hey, I'm going to be setting up tomorrow. Um, you know, what would work best for you? So that's in the summary. So we go back to the job itself. The other action you're going to want to do is hit start the job. Now this is independent of the timesheet. Right now this doesn't actually have anything to do with capturing time. It just lets us know, hey, I've arrived, I'm here, and I'm starting the job. Um, the other thing that it allows you to do is once you're done doing your booth setup, then I'm going to want you to take a picture of your booth just so that we can see it, see if anything needs to be edited or fixed um, or what have you. So once you've completed your setup, all you have to do is click on the booth picture icon. This will come up, tap it one more time, and your camera comes up. I'm going to go ahead and just take a little quick picture here. If you like it, you can hit the OK button. If you don't, you can hit retry. I'll go ahead and hit OK. You can enter any notes, like hello from Sacramento. Hit OK. Hit submit. And that'll send it to us so that we can see it. Now, you're not going to want to end your job until the entire roadshow um, is over, whether you're there for a couple of days or you're there for the entire duration of the show. Don't end it until you're completely done, you've packed up, and you're all set. So that's really it. So now the time card is still going. You can exit out of the application and go about working your day. Then when it's time for you to end your day, just go ahead and end your shift, and it ends it. And again, it sends us all the information that we need for that day. Exit out of that. Exit home and it's out of the application. Um, so then the next day, you show up to work, you're at Costco, you're ready to start work, open it up, go ahead and start your time card, and you can just go ahead and exit out, and it'll be recording your time the whole time until you hit start, or you hit stop, or until you go on a lunch break. The final thing you'll wanna do at the end of a road show is go back into the jobs. So let's just say it's Sunday night, or it's the last day of your show, or the last day of your job, you can go back to your actions and hit end job. That lets us know that the job is completely done, that you've packed up, that everything's ready for shipping, and you're all set to go. And that's it. 
And right now there's no more jobs. If you had future jobs assigned to you, they'd be showing up here in the dates that they're assigned. Um, and you can just do the same thing over and over. So it's really as simple as that. Just a few clicks of, a, of buttons and all of your time is captured and we can get a picture of the booth.